This is ridiculous, bro. All right, so I just got one pair on the Foot Locker app of the Beluga 2.0s. You already know, I'm not gonna show you guys too much information because I know you guys can use that. And let's see if I got two pairs. I struck out on foot action because I suck, but it's cool. All right, let's see, did I get them? I got them. Oh, that's two, two for three. All right, so right now we're in front of this restaurant called Bento. It's like an Asian restaurant and we're only here because my boy, well, it's funny because me and my boy, we're looking to buy some Yeezys on FSU Craigslist. And then you already know my boy Kosh came through. What's He's that? like, yo, what year are your Pirates Blacks? I'm like, 2016. No, he asked me the 2016. I said they were 2015. Yeah, 2015? Was that the first, first year came out? First, yeah, the first release, yeah, yeah. I don't know what year that 2015, is. 2015, I'm pretty sure. But we're trying to buy them, and that's my boy Santi right here, too. What's up, guys? <laughs> <laughs> we're trying to buy them, but the guy's selling over 350 dead stock, and that just seems too good to be true. And he's like, if you come now, I'll do three, three. He told me if I go right now, I'll do 300. He told him 275. But he only bought 250, so let's see if we can finesse maybe. I, I told him. If they're real, we'll buy them, obviously. That's the price of a steal. Yeah. And if they're fake, we'll still buy them for like $50. You know, I'll probably make a mask of it or something. Well, he's gonna buy them for 50, and I told him I'll buy it off him for 75. So he'd come up to, you know what I'm saying? It's a no, just, just a good little. sale. Just a little, little. Well, I'm gonna choose y'all boys. So those Yeezys ended up being fake. They were terrible. Well, they weren't terrible, they just weren't like good. The boost was just so shiny, it didn't look good. And some things were just slanted, they were off, it just didn't look right, the box was off, the label was off, everything was off. But they weren't terrible, I've seen worse Yeezys. But right now I'm about to go ask my roommate how he feels about copping these, because it's like his first Yeezy he's ever copped. But unfortunately he didn't get his size, but let's see how he feels. If I do a little quick interview real quick. Alright, so my boy already knows this boy, Tyreek TV, what's good? <laughs> how you feel about copping them Yeezys though? <laughs> I caught some easy guys, man. I'll tell you what, that's on me right there. That was, it took me like three hours. What you about to do with them though? I'm um, reselling. Because I ain't get my size. How much though? 425. Hey, you got 450, let me know. <laughs> you got 450? Huh? I'm selling 450. 450. Yeah. I mean, it's my homeboy, so. Oh, yeah, no. I still have one. I can sell it, but I'm just gonna hold on to it for a while. All right, so this is gonna be his first time actually looking at the shoe. He's seen all my Yeezys, but he hasn't seen this pair in particular. Like First one of the drop, off oh, real. You already won. Yeah, of course. Damn, this boy wearing his sneakers. I don't like how they had a heel tab. I don't want to get into a review because I'm, I'm going to do a review on the channel. And something else I don't like about them was the... I don't know if I like them that much, but... They smell fake, okay. bro. Oh, okay. A fishy. Yeah, okay. Oh, I, didn't, I didn't actually vlog me picking bro, them up, these but... hoes clean. This Yeezy's period clean, bro. I want hey, those. I'm trying to cop, like... <laughs> you trying to resell? Hell yeah. Bro, I thought about it. I was like taking a call the other day. I was like, damn, I should go back to reselling because yeah, you, you sold five pairs, bro. You got your pair paid for it and you got well, hella profit. So the way I think I'm gonna start making these vlogs is more like a vlog style kind of thing where I just like vlog throughout my day and then like I'll put some sneaker content in there. The majority is gonna be based off sneaker content because that's what this channel is about. Anyways, that's all I really wanted to say about what I'm gonna do with this channel. Nothing really crazy changing, just trying to like change it up a little bit. Anyways, today I wanna show you guys the pickups that I picked up over the past week, over like Black Friday week basically because Black Friday did start on Friday obviously, but there's always sales going on before that and on top of that I picked up a few things before that. So going in order, the first thing I picked up were these Supreme pickups. So there's one here and there's another one there the first one that i purchased was not this one but it is one of the two it is the independent collab i purchased it uh, i know this drop came out like two three weeks ago but i'm just not getting around to it because the only way i could ship it was to the house down in south florida so i have to go pick it up and then bring it up here it is the all white with the supreme going down the side i think i bought this for like 54 dollars after shipping and then they gave me the stickers which i already put on my laptop i'm trying to like fill my whole laptop with a bunch of like the supreme stickers the next one is this long sleeve one this is not the sweatshirt this is the long sleeve and obviously this color i don't know exactly what to call this color this one doesn't have really too much detail only on the front and the bottom it says like f the rest and then the back is just supreme on the top and really small letters which I probably won't even keep these two because first of all they're mediums they have like that skater fit to them so I know it's gonna fit too big I'm gonna sell both of them if you guys want them hit me up on Instagram or Twitter I will answer you guys if you guys ask about these in particular my next pickups were the EZ350 boost in the Beluga 2.0 colorway as you can see I have one pair above me right here right above the Beluga 1.0 but I did pick up two pairs one for myself and one to sell if I could sell it now at a good price then I'll sell it if not I'll just wait on it until the price goes up because the price will go up even though this is the least limited Yeezy that they have ever released. Yeezy Mafia actually just dropped a stock list, I guess if you want to call it that, where they show the amount of Yeezys that have released. And the ones that are least limited are the 2.0s, and then after that come the blue tint ones coming out next month, and which hopefully I can get those too, because those are super fire. Those are way better than the yellow ones. And the Yebras, which are the yellow ones, are the ugliest ones in my opinion. So I'm kind of glad I didn't really get them. I'm not too bummed out. But I mean, if I end up coming across them for a good price, then I probably will pick them up. And last but not least amongst these pickups, my favorite one and the best pickup of all time it is this Louis Vuitton pickup. If you guys saw, I posted all this on my Snapchat. Go ahead and follow me. It is Mebby underscore Heddle. I will leave the name to it down in the description below. I'll probably also like 
tag it somewhere around here. And this pickup was really expensive. I mean, it's a Louis Vuitton, of course. Authentic came straight out of Paris. So big shout out to my mom. She was there over like the past week or two. And I told her like, she goes across the store, like pick this up for me. And you guys are probably wondering what it is. And it is this wallet right here. It is a black monogram with the clip in, inside. It's not the multiple wallet. It's the, like it's a wire wallet. And it's also a taller wallet, which unfortunately, I mean, doesn't really bother me that much, but what I liked about it a lot was this clip right here. And I hope you guys didn't just see all my info, but it did come straight out of France. I will be doing a review on the Belugas and I also will be doing a review on the wallet because I know there's not many of those out there. And I want to show you guys in detail the wallet and talk about it and like just the whole process of how I got it or how my mom got it really because I didn't get it. Anyways, that's it for today, guys. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. The goal was 25,000 by the end of this month, but at this rate, I mean, we can hit 20,000 by the end of this month. So I hope we can do it. I am going to go back to uploading, like I said, every single day. I will have time now on top of that, the break is going to come up and I will have time to upload every single day. So there will be no excuses for me to not upload. Before I go, you guys know that I got to give a shout out to the fan of the day. And today's fan of the day does go to Tim Mpe. Anyway, that's it for today, guys. Stay tuned for the next one. Make sure you stay well. It's your boy Sneaker Sign out.